The first task for any beginner is learning that first programming language. But let's face it, there's distractions out there that can easily lead beginners down less effective learning pathways. So today, we're cutting through the noise. We're going back to basics with the terminal, your no-nonsense route to learning programming fundamentals. I'm Eric Wise from Skill Foundry, where we teach beginners how to code the right way. Now, you might be wondering, why the terminal? Well, have you ever played Battleship? I'm having a blast here with this terminal version made entirely with C-sharp code. No fancy graphics or HTML, CSS, or JavaScript here, just good old fashioned C-sharp. And sure, this application might seem a bit basic, but that's the beauty of it. It's all about what's under the hood. This little game is packed with key concepts that professional C-sharp developers need to master, like separation of concerns, unit testing, dependency injection, polymorphism, and more. And that's why we build this application in our object-oriented programming in C-sharp course on Skill Foundry. Many beginners are advised to dive into web applications first. And why not? It's easy, they say. And they're not wrong. It is a pretty easy path. But the problem is you end up juggling JavaScript, HTML, CSS, and one or more web frameworks at the same time. And frankly, not a lot of what you learn on that front end translates to backend development. The result is a lot of coders who have gaps in core coding fundamentals and application design. And in the current job market where there's a glut of front end developers, this is not where you want to be. So where should you start? Right here in the terminal, building a foundation on coding patterns and application design. And you should be using languages like C++, C Sharp, Java, and Python. And trust me, once you learn these foundations, picking up HTML, CSS, and JavaScript is a breeze. So if you're serious about starting a career in programming, then begin with the terminal and stay there until you master the core concepts of a programming language. This will really set you apart from front-end developers. And trust me, back-end development is not as tough as people make it out to be. And if you'd like to build that foundation in C-sharp, I've got you covered. Check the link in the description below for our free sample C-sharp course at Skill Foundry. Happy coding.